John Lippies, Week 4 Picks of the Week for the 2016 NFL season. All right, last week I was 9-7, and seven, a repeat performance of the previous week. I'm 25-23 and 23 on the year for a 521 win percentage. Currently ranked 224 out of 311 in my league. Okay, time to make excuses why I lost. The Patriots somehow beat the Texans, shut them out. Amazing. Jaguars, they let me down. I'm just not betting on them anymore. Redskins snuck a win versus my G-men. Holy Vikings, how did they beat the Panthers? The Eagles blew out the Steelers. Who saw that? And the Rams won by five to the to the Bucks, and it was a coast to coast game, so I was I failed on that. And then I made that emotional pick of the Jets just because I was infatuated with their offense, but no more. All right, let's get to some picks. Thursday night football: Miami Dolphins at Cincinnati Bengals. My pick: Bengals. And here is why. Both of Miami's centers did not practice Monday and Tuesday. The Dolphins were rolling against the Browns until the center Steen was injured. Miami should be 0-3 at this point. They, the, thankfully, the Browns, Parkey, missed three field goals and gave Miami the win. I'm happy about that. The Bengals played tougher teams than Miami did on their schedule and seemed to be the better 1-2 and two team. A.J. Green is better than every player on Miami's secondary. And now Miami has won the past three matchups versus the Bengals. I remember the last one, though. Geno Adkins got injured, and they were all close games. Miami has a 6-5 and five all-time record on Thursday night. Now, the Bengals do give up a lot of sacks, so Dominican Sue, Cameron Wake, Mario Williams should have a, a field day, hopefully. I think the Dolphins can win, but I'm hedging my bet, betting on the Bengals, so that if the Dolphins win, I'll be happy. I'll gladly pay for Dolphin wins. Indianapolis Colts versus Jacksonville Jaguars. My pick, Colts. Reason, I'm not betting on the Jags until they win a game. Detroit Lions versus Chicago Bears. My pick, Lions. Why? It's the smart pick. The Lions are better than the Bears. The Bears might sneak out a victory, but the smart pick is the Lions. Buffalo Bills versus New England Patriots. My pick, the Patriots. I bet against the Patriots twice already this year. It was dumb. It was stupid. I'm going with the Patriots. I don't care if they got their fifth string quarterback in. At this point, Patriots until they lose. Cleveland Browns versus Washington Redskins. My pick, Redskins. Don't get excited about the Browns. They looked good against the Dolphins. Redskins beat the G-Men last week. Redskins are at home. Oakland Raiders at Baltimore Ravens. My pick, Ravens. Why? Ravens are undefeated. Oakland's got to travel from California to the East Coast. Carolina Panthers at Atlanta Falcons. My pick, Atlanta Falcons for the upset of the week. Might sound crazy, but the Falcons are at home. I don't know if you saw Devontae Freeman last, uh, last week against the Saints, but man, he was tearing it up on Monday night. The Falcons put up a bunch of points against the Saints, and they also had this other running back that was finishing it at the goal line scoring touchdowns. They looked hot. And I didn't even say Julio Jones' name yet. Seattle Seahawks at New York Jets. My pick, Jets. Reason, remember, Seattle is beatable away. It's when they're at home that they're unstoppable. The Jets still have their awesome offense. Seattle's defense is really good. We'll see what happens. We'll see if Seattle can win on the road, but I'm going with the Jets at home. Tennessee Titans at Houston Texans. My pick, Texans. My reason, the Texans got embarrassed so hard by the Patriots that I think they're going to bounce back here at home, even without J.J. Watt. Their offense still has Brock Osweiler, Lamar Miller, and DeAndre Hopkins. Denver Broncos at Tampa Bay Buccaneers. My pick, Broncos. Reason, the Broncos are undefeated. Los Angeles Rams at Arizona Cardinals. My pick, Cardinals, why it's at home. And you figure at some point the Cardinals got to remember that they're a good team. New Orleans Saints at San Diego Chargers. My pick, Saints. The Saints are 0-3. They got to look at their schedule and say the Chargers are a winnable game. We got to get this one. So I'm going with the Saints. Dallas Cowboys at San Francisco 49ers. My pick, the Cowboys. Dak Prescott looked really good against the Bears. They got two great, three great running backs. And the 49ers starting quarterback is Blaine Gabbert. Kansas City Chiefs at Pittsburgh Steelers. My pick, Steelers. Reason, Steelers got embarrassed just like the Texans got embarrassed. It's time for the Steelers to save face and show the Chiefs that the Steelers are still the Steelers. New York Giants at Minnesota Vikings. My pick for the insane pick of the week, I'm going with the Giants. Sure, the Vikings are 3-0. But the Giants offense, it's time to wake up. They got to win. They got to show it off. 
It's Monday Night Football. Victor Cruz is going to do his dance. Odell Beckham Jr. is going to shine on the biggest stage. And the Vikings fairy tale has to end at some point. On by this week, we have the Eagles and the Packers. And that about does it for week four picks. I'm not claiming I'm the best picker in the world. Obviously, I transparently show my record, show my flaws. If you got any objections, go ahead and leave it in the comments. How are you feeling about this week?